left to buy ketchup, house burnt down. Oh, 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 oh. What's up? up? Today we're in Middleton, Wisconsin. And we are at the Mustard Museum. The National Mustard Museum. I don't like mustard. I love mustard. <laughs> so let's check this place out. <laughs> Where are we right now? In the gift shop. And we're gonna go to the We're gonna go to the downstairs into the mustard mm -hmm. museum. I got a dollar. Support the mustard. The first 27 virtues of mustard. Don't touch them. But here they are. Let's read some of them off. We have confident. Affectionate, Goal, grateful, kind, nimble, humble, let's see, fluffy, huh? <laughs> Observant. What is mustard? Huh. It's known as a yellow condiment squirted on hot dogs and hamburgers. That's what I know it as. So where does mustard even come from? Okay. There's three different kinds of mustard seeds, yellow, brown, and black. This is interesting. It's very interesting. The black mustard seed's the smallest of them. I didn't even know it was a seed, dude. What is that? What is that? This is yellow mustard, and when you open it, you see that it is put on hot dogs. Okay. Then we have black mustard, and this looks like a cooking mustard. And then we have the brown, which is also a cooking mustard. Mm. Wow, mustard seeds are, are very tiny, and a relatively small amount is required to plant a large field. An acre of farmland requires only six to 12 pounds of seeds. Shannon, what game are you playing? A food game. Food? Yeah. The famous mustard grape poupon is so named because in French, grape poupon means what? Let's party. <laughs> <laughs> now, probably affordable and elegant. Let's see. I don't it know. Was probably let's party. You messed up. Look at all these mustards in cans. Right here, look. Mustard from Zanzibar. That's gotta be like expensive. And then look at all of these mustards in cans. That's crazy. Can O mustard. Oh, oh a, wait, there's, a, there's a song about mustard. Mustard, mustard, you gotta put it on your hot dog. Mustard, mustard, it's really freaking good. Oh, look at this cute little dog. He prom he's promoting mustard. He's like, I choose mustard. So I ran into this French's yellow mustard costume and like the eye hole is pretty creepy. Don't you think? Look at this. Looks like a bee kind of. It does. It kind of looks like you're gonna go. Uh, What's it called? A bee farmer. <laughs> you know. Wow, it's a little bit taller than you. It is. And it's your hat's kind of pointy, just like it. Do I look like a mustard thing? Yes. Like. <laughs> What'd you find down there? This weird fun family food thing. Look at this. Fun family Would food. you eat that? What is that? It looks like carrots for hair. What's the white? Like egg whites? No, it looks like maybe mayo. Oh, gross. Mayo and there's ham in there. Ham? I don't know. It's on an English muffin. Ah, pass. I don't know if I could do that. It's a hard pass. Look at this kid eat, eating this hot dog here. And he's hungry, man. Look at this. He's about to eat it. Yum, 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 yum. <laughs> Forest scent. Mama always said mustard is as mustard does. There is a huge wall of mustard here. Look at this. It goes from top to bottom of the wall with different types of mustards. You think this is a huge wall? Wait till we see this other wall over here. It's like quadruple the size of this with mustard. I didn't know there was this much mustard. I know. I didn't think you could, you could do this many combinations of mustard seeds. Wow. That's nuts. 
I never even tried mustard before. Did you find Illinois? Right here. What do they got? Mustard. Utah doesn't have very many musters. They only have a couple in the small little section. But above Utah is Texas. And they have like shelves and shelves and shelves of mustard. Because everything's bigger in Texas right here. Even the mustard seeds. I was wrong. Wisconsin has the most shelves. Look. They have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve shelves of mustard. That is crazy. What would be a museum without Disney inspired anything? Look, we got the Disney mustard. You got the Goofy, you got the Mickey. Yep. You got the. Uh, Donald, Donald, Duck's, Donald, Duck's. Donald Duck's nephews, Yogi Bear. Crazy. We have some mustard flavored candy. Matt, would you eat that? Uh, probably not. Gross. And then we have some Valentine's. Wait, wait, wait. Look at this. Look at this, look at this sexy hot dog right here. Huh? Oh, wow, man. I've never seen such a sexy hot dog in my life. Do you think they're going to get it on? Mustard's going to get it on the hot dog? I don't know. That's what you do with mustard. You put it in a hot dog, right? We have lots of mustard knickknacks. Look at this little French bulldog. He's like, give me the mustard. And then you got this guy with a mustache, and he's like, I mustache you for the mustard. And then you have this like weird like pickle looking thing. Like a, I don't know what that is. Now over here, they have all these like antique mustard. Like I guess you put mustard in them. That's crazy. Look at it. This, this is the this is the fancy ones. <laughs> there are even mustards from different countries. We have Italy, Iceland, Spain, Portugal, Australia, or Austria, sorry, Czech <laughs> Republic, Ukraine, Switzerland, and the Netherlands. Wow, they have a lot of mustards there. Wow. They even have ads or covers of magazines cover. that show mustard. So here is a Rolling Stone cover with Jenny McCarthy, and she's pouring that mustard. She's piling it on. This is a mustard vending machine, and it is the world's first and only. First and only? Look at this. A4. I want to get me some whole grain mustard, three dollars. Three bucks. Mustard. The little tube that could, this may be the tiniest container of mustard ever made. And it was on the British Airways in the 1960s. Ah, good old flight mustard. Is this the proper use of, the, of Mickey Mouse? I don't think it is. Mustard is over his eyes. Got mustard? On your lip? <laughs> Left to buy ketchup, house burnt down. <laughs> First shot thrown, man. Mustard one, ketchup zero. <laughs> Ch Chying, dude. Supposedly, if you squeeze gently, gently, an empty scent dispenser, you get good luck. So here we go. Gently squeezed. Good luck. So at the Mustard Museum, they have over 6,000 mustards on display. So behind me is a huge wall of all the mustards from the 50 states. And then they have other sections by country. So it's pretty amazing. I didn't even know there was this many kinds of mustard. I didn't, it's like blowing my mind. And I, I've never even tried mustard, so we're gonna go upstairs and try some mustard. What are you trying, Which, what flavor? Sweet and nicely hot. Okay. Double dipping. Let's get a bunch on here. Show it. Hold on. Ah, it's going. Okay, now Look try it. it. Yeah. Are you ready? Whew. It's, it's a that, sweet bump. It's hot? Yeah. You think I would like it? No. Alright, let's try it. 
Look at the camera. It's like honey mustard mixed with horseradish. Oh, dang. Oh, it's getting me. <laughs> In the back. <laughs> Matt's gonna try the sweet and nicely hot, which I'm scared. Ready? Go ahead. Whoa, dude. It's like... It's sticky, yeah. Oh, boy. Oh, no. Let's see. All right, I'm going. Oh, whoa, it gets you in the end. Yep. <sighs> God, I didn't put any more on there. Are you done yet? Gross. We got some beer mustard. Mike and I are gonna try this beer mustard. I gotta wash the taste out of my mouth in that other one, and I like it. So this looks like a more no this looks like, no like a normal mustard I would probably like. All right, so let's see. Smell it. Smells like mustard. Does it taste like beer? Not really. <laughs> it's just that you get that tang of mustard. It's, like, it's, it's tangy. <laughs> it's mustard. <laughs> Okay. Yeah, I like that one better than the other one. That actually makes me want to put mustard on my hamburger now. I, whoa, dude, 36 years old. Mustard's good. <laughs> I really like caramel, so this is a caramel mustard. Look at that. It looks like caramel, right? Yeah. Yeah. All right. Uh, mm, Feliz Navidad. It's very, it's very, it's very weird. Uh. All right, I'm trying the caramel mustard. I already have it here on the item. On the item? It's a pretzel. Pretzel ready? Hold on. It's fine. Dude, I got like hints of vomit, dude. It tastes like caramel. Yeah, load it on because you're really going to love it. <laughs> All right, dill pickles. That's a no. That's a that's a no. Pecan and not honey mustard. All right, let's try it. Oh, it's thick. Verdict? You have a taste of pecan in it. <laughs> Matt doesn't like any of the mustard. I like the root beer one. <laughs> got the cherry mustard. Cherry mustard? I got a cranberry mustard. You go first. Good? I don't taste the cherry. You just taste mustard? Yeah. Nice. All right, cranberry mustard right here. I smell mustard. But it looks like cranberry. Yeah. Right. Name of flavor That's your face on every mustard. Because I taste the spice. And I don't like it. It's milder than some of the other ones, but I would maybe like try that on turkey. Turkey mustard. Which one is it? Chipotle. Ooh, smoky chipotle. chipotle. Go ahead. The whole thing. Gross, gross, gross. <laughs> what do you got now? Pumpkin mustard. Okay, go. Whole thing. Interesting. This is my favorite mustard in the world. Yeah. <laughs> Why? Because it just tastes like pumpkin and not mustard? It's sweet. It tastes like pumpkin and it's mustard. Nice. Dude. It's home run with that one, right? My favorite. Where's this one at? Right here, the winner of the day. Pumpkin honey mustard. Shannon's going to buy a case of it. What's up, Mustard Museum, Middleton, Wisconsin. Heaven on earth if you like mustard. So good, you can try <laughs> any, mustard. any mustard in any there. Mustard. And I just wanna say thanks to Mike
from Adventures with Mike. Check his YouTube channel out for suggesting we come to this place and hanging out with us today. It was super fun. Go check his channel out. I'll put the link down below. And then we have a giveaway from the day. This is a jar opener with the Mustard Museum logo on it. So to be entered in a giveaway, just like, share, and subscribe. Leave a comment when you do all that, and I'll enter you in to the giveaway. What? Free and, giveaway. And then, uh, when we, you month. might need to open your mustard jar yes. with this. And so in a month or so, I'll pick a, a winner uh, with a random comment generator website. So check that out. And if you're ever in Middleton, Wisconsin, come out to the Mustard Museum and get your tongue all spicy licking mustard. <laughs> and I'll, and I'll, and they I'll. have sweet mustard They do too. have sweet mustard too, but it's mainly I bought spicy. One. It's mainly spicy mustard. It really passes the mustard. Yeah, mustard gas over here, this guy. And they got good pretzels. <laughs> So, Two dollar pretzels. Eat the pretzels. Yep. You could put all your mustards on them. <laughs> Until the next mustard gas video. <laughs> well, well, bye. bye. Oh man, I can't, I can't wait to open this mustard now. I just can't get enough. Oh. Nom, 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 nom. Are you excited for the mustard museum, Shannon? Yes, I love mustard. <laughs> I love it with hot dogs. I love them it in potato salad. Oh yeah, but, but corn ooh, dogs. Yeah, oh no, not corn dogs. Yeah. I, I'm not a fan of mustard other than mustard potato salad. But uh, you think all the mustards here are made from real turds or what? I hope not. <laughs>